Hello everybody and um, welcome back. Today we're going to be doing an update on this Lego City. Which I do personally like. No, it's not over here. There's a new stunt spike there. Um, lots of things have happened. <coughs> this bit. Lego City. I've added some new things and I've changed some things around. The main thing I want thing I want to show you is this right here. It's a bookshop. This one is easy to remove. It's not connected to loads of studs. So I'll just um, move this over to another space. Here we are. <coughs> so this is the book. It's not a cough. Not the nose. This is City Bookshop. Um, looks like a nice um, bookshop. There's a little CD and writing. There's some windows either side of the double doors it's not too bright in there because I've only got like four windows so I've got um window here window there window there the door and the door I do like these double doors now. We'll be putting more of them around my city. Looks nice in there. So, let's go around. In here. I don't know what's sold in here. Tom Gates books. My favourite of the series. Around here. Is the back. So we have the back door, which goes into the mall. And there's the bins, beside the bins. In the wall, there's a little um, mouse hole there. Because what I decided to put by the bins um, is a rat. I got these bins from the Lego Friends set. And here. A, a window. Front again. Nothing really on the roof. There's only one minifigure in here because I couldn't find any other minifigures around to put in here. So, not to be like, um, produce It's only meant to be a small community building. So there's the, um, administration desk, which doesn't really have anything on it yet. I've just forgotten about that. There's the um, bookshop owner who looks like a real book um, fiction book character herself. Oh yeah, there's her materials. She's standing right behind the door, the staff only door. And there's actually a real air vent. In the, the door, like the the hole there, this doesn't open really well. But the back it does open, and there's the back door. And there's the mouse hole. Nothing really in that storage space. Uh, but here is a public area. So here we have some books. So there are some small books 
there are some there's a clearance table books from A to Z or the A to Z books from that bookshelf and these are the Tom Gates books here's the bookshelf this is removable oh it just broke apart so see more of these in in a brick layout it's broken so it's got I've just put my hand in here now move it it might take a bit of time okay. we'll just fix it again There we go. This is a two story bookshelf. Lots of books in it. So books here. Removable. Taking out where's one as the these are one by two plates. Some of them are jump plates, so I just went to make use of everything I had. Then the last book is one by two tile. Well it's on one side. That side that side. Yeah. So I'll just put these back in. Yeah. It's got some of these from my original. So they I made. If it wasn't for the pick a brick at Edinburgh. So uh, if you're wondering I had a good time at Edinburgh. in Edinburgh, I was able to find these bricks. So if it had not been for the Lego store in Edinburgh, if that Lego store had not opened, I wouldn't have built this bookshop. I would not have had the idea to. Anyways. Yeah, I do really like how this turned out. So I will increase it. Goodness. And I'm in the next update. Oops, that just fell off. Oh dear, what was that? My wall and my connector. Just out by the back door. Just finish it now as a bit too. There we go. Bins need to go in the back. Still need something to connect it to the roof. <coughs> <coughs> so they won't keep on going in the wrong direction. So beautiful. I should sometimes um, try to put a skyline.
hope it doesn't cringe from as this. Made from mini figures, not for YouTube. Grab the bins. Yeah, Tom Gates poster doesn't really show because the roof ran, so I'm moving it. He must, he's put Van there, not on the road. He must love Tom Gates. I'm not going to the bookshop. Oh well. So, that is my bookshop. Corrected. I have a few other things I want to do in this Lego City. I put this new flat in. Which is beautiful flat. So, I'll just get over here. Not too much detail. So, roof isn't too easy to remove, so I'm not going to remove it. Duh. I'll just show you through the windows instead. Yeah, I put a lot of windows into this. There's still not too much light. <coughs> Probably because of the constricted space. These into the bathroom. No one knows. Here. See if we can that. Open up a window here. Here. Let's go make some of the balcony back there. Put the pan here. Yeah, this will be Chimney is also the roof connectors. Um, yeah. Roof connectors. Right. And there's some updates about Debenhams. First update. I've added a new door in. Them, so I've got another one of these. I like how I've used the berry pieces. Just move the wheelbarrow out the way. Oops. Have to be connected back here. Oh well. Might as well just use studs. Come on. Come. Here, I put the cycle bins there because I don't know how much this bookshop loves to recycle, but we need general waste bins too. I don't know about you, but I might move bins from over here. I think I've got too many bins. Okay, right. Thank you very much for watching. Just kidding. It's still yet to go through. I've changed out the table and the um, registration table there. Because, um, first of all, it's just like a mess. So, yeah. I thought, thought it's not in my good work, so change it out. So, I need to end the video now. Thanks for watching. Please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.